Hi, I'm Matt. And I'm Dave. And in this Magento Basics tutorial, you're going to learn how to remove the Powered by Magento link at the bottom of your Magento website. That's right. Now we're going to jump across to Magento and we'll catch up there with you in a few moments time. OK, Dave, we've been to come across to our Magento website and we're using the Ultimo theme, which we've got a whole course on to show you how to do that. But that aside, we've got a snazzy looking website. So we've got some fantastic menus up here at the top. OK, we've customized it. We've created a slider for the top area of our Magento website. We've even put products on our home page and put in to our latest tweets and our Facebook page in there as well. But when we scroll right down to the bottom of the page, we get the demo store notice. How frustrating. <laughs> Yeah, we want to get rid of that. <laughs> Definitely want to get rid of that. Now, this is good news, really simple to do. So follow us along in your Magento system. So you're going to want to go to your Magento dashboard, OK? And then from the top, go to System, down to Configuration. And then on the left-hand side, underneath General, I'm going to pause and highlight this on your screen for you. So underneath the General section where it says Design, click on to design. Now the section which we're after in here, Dave, is called footer. So we can see that row there called footer. We need to click on that row and expand it out. And look, there's our demo store notice. So we want to get rid of that, but we also want to replace it with some better looking code. So I'm going to copy and paste the ones which we actually use in the main tutorials over at understandingne.com. And a little note here is that short codes or tags or widget codes do not work in this box. You have to write pure HTML. So if you want to link to your home page, then you've got to put the full path. In fact, let me just expand this out just to explain it. So if you want a link to your home page, then you will have to put the full path in there. You can't use any of the Magento short codes like media URL for an image, for example. They won't work in this box. So with that said, we've been and got a copyright notice in there 2012 to 2015. OCU or all rights reserved. And then we've got three links in there, one to our home page, one to our privacy policy, and the other one to our contact us page. Page. Now, once we've been and changed that, or once you've been and changed that on your Magento website, press Save Config at the top. Now, Dave, because we don't know if you watching this have a full page cache extension or if you have the Magento cache enabled, so we're going to do one extra step before we nip back to our Magento website and check. So go up to System and then go down to Cache Management. Then on the left hand side, click on the link which says Select All. And then on the right hand side, press submit. Nice and easy there, Dave. Select all, <laughs> submit. Yeah, that was Dave proof for sure. Excellent. So eight cache types refreshed. Let's go back to our Magento website. So there's the demo store notice. Let's go and refresh this page now. It will take a few moments because again, remember we cleared all the caches out. And excellent. There's our notice down here, 2012 to 2015 O2U, little copyright notice. And we've also got free links, home, privacy policy, and contact us. Nice and easy, Dave. Nice and easy, pal. Excellent. So from myself, Matt. And from me, Dave. Cheerios. So from myself, Matt. And me, Dave. We hope that you found this video tutorial helpful. If you have, then let us know by leaving a thumbs up on this video below or subscribing to our YouTube channel. We believe to use Magento, you don't need a degree in Nerd, and we've created you over 300 step-by-step -step video tutorials at understandinge.com to help you. In these tutorials, you'll learn how to use Magento with no prior knowledge. How to build a fully responsive Magento website for just $99, which is about 65 quid. How you can use Magento to sell on eBay and Amazon with M2E Pro. And you'll be joined by over 6,000 fellow business owners just like you. And the best part is, it's free to join. So for myself, Matt. And me, Dave. We'll see you there. Cheerios.